remember to stay hydrated. And today we are taking a look at the best knife for under $250, let's get it. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Everyday Minimalist. My name is Brandon and I hope you're having a great day. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at my most favorite knife under $250. Now there are a ton of different options at the $250 and below category. And you guys might have different opinions. Let me know in the comment selection below. This is just my number one pick. So let's just get right into it. What is my favorite knife at $250? That would be none other than the ProTec Malibu. The reason why I love this knife so very much is because of its overall minimalistic design. It's very pocketable. It's not very threatening when you pull this out in like an office environment, for example. And I'm happy to say that I've owned one for about a year and a half now. So this thing has been tried and true. All Malibus are not going to be priced at $250. You can find them for about $200 retail cost if you can find them in stock. This knife is extremely hard to recommend just because they sell out so quickly when they hit the dealer floors. Now, there's a reason why the Malibu will sell out within minutes or seconds when they do hit the floors. And the reason being is because this thing is just so damn good. It's 100% USA made. You've got a 20 CV blade along with some really nice aluminum scales. This thing features a very nice deep carry pocket clip that fits within the pocket very well. It just nests in there and then goes away, which is absolutely perfect. And of course the Malibu is well known for its button lock locking mechanism. This thing is absolutely smooth and I own two of them in my personal collection. This is actually one of the newest knives in my collection and this is the textured Malibu. So for example, on a normal Malibu, you just have this really smooth scale. So there's really no grit to it. It's just super smooth, but the only thing I dislike about it is it's very fingerprint attractive. On the textured version, it doesn't really attract fingerprints, which is a huge change. Even with the textured Malibu coming in at about 200 to 230 bucks at retailers, this thing is so fantastic. It's actually a lot more different in hand than what you would think, even if you own or have handled a Malibu. Now, of course, there are a bunch of other options. For example, here's the Demco 80 20.5. This is a fantastic option in the $150 range, as well as the Benchmade Bugout 535-3. This is a fantastic fantastic knife as well, but it does not beat out the ProTec Malibu. They're very similar in total size, as you guys can tell, but in terms of overall carry use and everything, I think the Malibu is gonna beat out the Benchmade Bugout. This knife is absolutely superb and I can recommend it to anyone as long as you can get one in your hands. Which brings us to the solution in this video. How can you get your hands on a ProTec Malibu? As I said earlier, Malibus will sell out instantly as soon as they hit the retailers. And my solution to that is actually hit up the guys that I go to, bladeops.com. You guys have probably heard of them if if you've been following me for a while now. And I heard that they're gonna be getting a bunch of these in. So what you're gonna wanna go ahead and do to get in contact with them is just email sales at bladeops.com. Let them know that Brandon or Everyday Minimalist had sent you. And you guys might get the chance to purchase one of these Malibus. They'll actually add you onto a wait list. And then as soon as those knives show up, they will instantly shoot you an email back letting you know like, hey, this thing is available, do you want it? And then that's when you guys are gonna be able to pull the trigger on one of these sweet knives. I know I kept this video super short and I did that on purpose just because I have so many other projects to work on this week. But if you guys enjoyed these really quick videos, I can probably pump one of these out per month. Just let me know in the comment selection below and then maybe we can just scale down or scale up the budget category. Aside from that, guys, go get yourself a Malibu. Thank you so much for spending your time with me today and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.